Hello everybody and welcome to the Dairy Barn Arts Center in Southeastern Ohio, Appalachia. Uh, my name is Carrie Gunter Seymour. I am the Poet Laureate of Ohio and I'm also the Executive Director and Founder of the Women of Appalachia Project and that's why we're here today. This amazing arts exhibition of women from throughout Appalachia um, there are 420 counties. Not all those counties are represented here in this exhibit, but they have been over the years. Um, about 15 years ago, I had it in my mind that I was getting a little bit um, fed up with being judged um, according to my twang in my voice. I was submitting my photography and my poetry for publication. And the rejections were saying very odd things that seemed a little bit like isms to me. Uh, things like uh, a little too ethnic or way too colorful. And I started realizing this is who we are in Appalachia. We are colorful and we are ethnic and we're very proud of our culture and the land and our heritage and our ancestors and all these things that others were not quite understanding and I realized there was a need for a little bit of education. I have a background in communications marketing and um, in speaking with other Appalachian artists, I realized they were having the same issue. And I thought, I could do an art show. I could do uh, some sort of poetry reading. So I approached the Multicultural Center at Ohio University and my pitch was that Appalachian women are a minority and they agreed. And thus bloomed the Women of Appalachia Project 2009, March Women's History Month. And now we're fast forward 14 years later. This is the 14th annual event. Um, over the years, I uh, continued the fine art exhibitions and the spoken word exhibitions that grew into an anthology. This is volume eight. And I realized about five years ago that I couldn't possibly do just, just full justice to a fine arts exhibition and a 250 page anthology. I was sitting on the board of the Dairy Barn Arts Center and I approached them about taking on the fine art exhibit. They agreed. And here we are in this amazing space with this marvelous artwork from throughout Appalachia and beyond because you know many of us have out migrated over the years or our families have but we still have those wonderful roots that tie us to Appalachia, those isms that others uh, give us those stereotypes that we find beloved. You know, you can go ahead and call us hillbillies because we love that, because that means it's about us. Um, concerning all of the work, whether it be the fine art or the written work, we don't have to march, we don't have to carry signs. Our work speaks for itself. And I invite you all to go on the tour with us to see this magnificent collection of artwork from so many amazing, talented women. And I encourage you to order the anthology Women Speak, Volume 8 from Sheila Nagig Editions and also enjoy an amazing variety of, um, of written work. And also there's fine art in this book as well. So please, I encourage you to come and see the exhibit any chance you get, read the book, and join us for this marvelous tour. Thank you.